was good, y'all. Fats here with another banger. Today we got Skip and Shannon, Cowboys eliminate Tom Brady on the and the Bucks. Uh, I did want to watch this segment. I did say yesterday that I'd probably do this segment uh, tomorrow. I usually just Skip and Shannon every Monday here after the NFL games. and um, But obviously Brady and the Cowboys being probably the two biggest NFL topics on their show. And I do watch a lot of Skip and Shannon. Um, I had to watch this segment. So let's get into it. Let's see what they got to say, man. Can't believe the Cowboys won. I still am in shock. Still depressed about it. Still so upset. Brady just... Buccaneers just got... Just, it was bad. It was bad, man. But let's go and see what they got to say. Now I got to listen to Skip, man. Now I got to listen to Skip. But the good thing is, Brady lost, so... It's far more, far less than what they average all year. Mm. Kudos to the Dallas Cowboys. I gave the Cowboys some kudos. Watch the reaction. If they can package that up, bottle it, ship it to San Francisco... They can't though. They can't. That team that you saw they can't. Night, ladies and gentlemen, is good enough to win a Super Bowl. No. Mm, but I also saw them just a week before score six points. Yep. So we're gonna talk about this. They'll get destroyed next week. Little... They're getting destroyed. Tom Brady. Wow. A season to forget. Eight and ten. For real. Three QBR. For real. Six multi touchdowns. It was a bad season. Man. It was a bad year. They were lucky to even be a day. Obviously. The, the, playoff, the most mm. of his career. Hmm. So Tom Brady looked like he had looked all year. He looked bad, man. Bad. The mm. Cowboys looked as good as I've seen them ever, and, and since Dak's been there seven years. Yeah. That might have. That was one of Dak's oh, best games ever. Messed that game up. That he had five touchdowns. A complete demolition job that you will see a team. Mm -hmm. They were complete. They ran the ball well enough. Dak Prescott. Mm. You did. Look, you look I gave him his credit. Heyman, you look like that played really good. At the absolute best. Mm. I just wish he have threw that touchdown to uh, Dalton Show so he could have had five touchdowns. Mm. Hey, four in a rushing touchdown mm. with no turnovers. Kudos to you, Jack. You're going to be Offensive Player of the Week. I, Brock Purdy, Probably. you had it for a while, but I got to give it to Dak Prescott because what mm. he did last night, mm. given what he nah, was give Yeah, I, I gave the Cowboys no their credit, not too much credit because they don't deserve that much credit, but I gave him a little bit of credit. Hey. I ain't got nothing to and give. I gave Dak his credit for sure. Okay, he's letting Skip go early. I need to check with the control room. Is the show over yet? We might only have like 30 seconds left. Man, I went for five minutes. The show Whoa. starts at 6.30 and it's 6.35. I, I think you went for 12 minutes. No, no, I've never heard anything like it. You Hold just on. broke the record. Hold on. Hmm. Dak, Prescott, <laughs> Dak Prescott last night broke the Cowboy playoff record for consecutive passes, breaking Troy Aikman's record. You just said an undisputed record Damn. for words spoken before I get to speak. I went for yeah. ladies and gentlemen, you see yeah. that? What kind of background is that? Uh, I think you tricked that <laughs> That's CGI. <laughs> Skip's funny. Nah, nah, Skip. You got the jokes. You got the jokes today, Skip. You got jokes today. Fuck. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Last night was a tour de force by my Dallas Cowboys. Damn it. Start to finish, back and forth, up and down, every way, shape, and form, except for my kicker who kicked me right in the you know what's last night. That was funny. Four times, and we are going to get to him in a few minutes here on this show. Mm. But right now is not his time or his turn okay. to be dealt with because it is time to deal with my. This guy skip, man. Thank you for saying what I was about to say, which is last night I saw a Super Bowl team. Again, they have to replicate. Not happening, bro. It's not happening, dog. You're tripping, bro. It's against the Bucks. The Bucks were trash. The Panthers would have done a better job, man. The Panthers would have done a better job, man. Everything will ratchet up. The degree of difficulty yeah. will go up into the, the San Francisco Saturday 8:15. Sheesh! It's our time. Saturday 8:15. That's what I'm waiting for. That's all I'm waiting for here. Saturday. This coming Sunday night. 815, man. Four point underdog as opposed to a two and a half point favorite last night. Mm. But in this game, this played out exactly like I thought it would play out. You thought yeah. it would be a close game. You said it would be 22 to 20. So you had some respect for the GOAT because you thought the GOAT and his defense might keep it fairly close. Well, yeah, I thought it was, the I defense thought it was and the GOAT did trash. I did not expect Dallas trash. to play like I don't think anybody thought they would play like this, Gil. Well, I called it yesterday. Listen, Dallas played well, but I think the Bucks are trash, man. I, I actually think the Bucks are trash. Seventeen going to the fourth right. quarter, and you that defense is garbage. Like, what? Yeah. And they were up eight. That offense was somehow garbage this year. Everything they had. Because they're just as I, I said all week long. They're just way better than the Tampa Bay Bucks from start to finish. In any Probably, way, yeah. shape, or form you want Probably. to try to to decipher what's left. Cowboy defense Bay is definitely Bay better than the Bucks My defense. My team is just better. I guess the so offense, their offense is better too. I guess because Tony Pollard is better than any player on the Bucks. I guess. Shit. Dak, I'm gonna quote myself. I said Dak Prescott will have all night to throw at Tampa. 
That's all he had was all night long. Could we queue up the song all night? We can do a little line. No, we can't. We can't skip. We can't do that. Yeah, skip. We can't do that. Skip. One uncharacteristic explosion rush that I, I barely, I might have seen one. I'm gonna watch this whole thing. I'm gonna skip a little bit. Three of his years at Tampa Bay with not committing a cardinal sin one time. You don't put no stats on the board. And and they're talking about it. There, he was down. I thought that was another turnover, but this is the turnover. Yeah. Yeah. Talk about that Brady turnover. Over, man. The Cardinals Talk about that Brady turnover, though. It had been for Brady. He had been at that, 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 that changed the game. They could have gone down, scored, man. That was bad. When that happened, I was shook. Okay, so he'd gone all I was three shook. Of his years at Tampa Bay with not committing a cardinal sin he one time. Being okay, you know they, they, they put did. no stamp they, on the board. And, and they're talking about it. They're raving about it. And I'm like, uh-oh, it's the classic announcer <laughs> from Joe Buck and Troy Aikman. And Joe Buck. And he did that. And it Damn. wasn't like, oh, I made a bad choice. He just didn't get enough on the right. ball because he ducked. Mm -hmm. Because he's 40. But I, there was no one even there, though. I don't even think there was anyone there, man. Like, there was literally no one there. That didn't have enough on it. And it's the football game. Because that's it. If you if you go 70 and 14 plays and you come away with zero, and that's it's tragic. To nothing because it cut, you're that's not, tragic. You had an opportunity as bad as you played up until that point. It was tragic. The whole game was damn tragic. All. <laughs> that shit was tragic. And then we go the other direction. And <clears throat> we go 80 yards and 15 plays. But all of a sudden, they try Zeke on third down. And, and I got to tell you, as much as I love Zeke, I just I, I I just don't see much left. Skip, there. I just don't I, see. Skip, I, I don't even get why they try it anymore. Well, maybe it's me, Skip, but I, I'm not so sure he gets the same block in his Pollard. I just don't know because it's hard to watch. Because, it is. It is. You know, he's he, definitely a plow horse he, now. He's a plow horse. He's more yeah. of a fullback than a halfback. He's one so yard. I'm looking for. He's, he's good on fourth and one if anyone. He usually gets all of those. He had 12 touchdowns this year, which is actually really good. Um, and he missed like two two games, right? Beating the table over here. I don't know, man. More number 20. I need to see Tony Pollard. And we're yeah. going to get into this all week. Yes, this is just me. I'm going to throw this out because I know this will suck. Oh, he's going to have to have a big game. Yes, the I Niners. know it's going to be Christian Everything. McCaffrey against Tony Pollard. Yeah. And they do a lot of the same things. Right. McCaffrey's better. I'll still take my man Tony Pollard nope. because I think he's Hell a touch no. faster than Christian is. And yeah. He's great as Christian is. Yeah. I think Christian is way, a way better receiver because if you Way better. Him, like, way better, dog. Yeah, like, it's not, like, like it's McCaffrey's way, like, it, it's well, it's different. It's the goat when Brady went out there. I'll give you Pollard's faster. Pollard is definitely faster. Pollard is different. Pollard is too fast. That's a close call, but I'll still take my guy because my guy is explosive okay so what happens we get down there and zeke gets stuffed and all of a mm. sudden it's fourth and goal to one. and troy aikman says on television I, man i'm i'm just gonna take the three here mm -mm. well little did we know i was thinking that low key but then it didn't even matter uh -huh. didn't maybe matter, you man. wouldn't want to take the three right well, we took skill we talked i talked about i said skip you remember you used to call the man Brett the Fret. Oh, I got all the confidence in the world in him now. I said, Oh, you were sure. Okay. You said you were sure about it. Okay. Are you that, still sure? This year they've been calling. Brett Maher has been good this year. This is really weird. Um, he'll be fine next year, I feel like. Maybe Maher. But the, but the, maybe Maher is right. <laughs> maybe Maher. Was, he was 19 oh, to 22 shit. on field goals this year. And, and the weird thing about this game last night, nobody, there's no field goals attempted. None. It was all about the extra it's, points. Oh, right. Fortunately, because. The threes can get you. I really thought he was missing all those extra points for a reason, man. I really did think that he was missing those extra points for a reason. I was like, that good. I was like, that goat is coming. The goat is going to come back. Well, he said, let's Not even a chance, bro. Okay. All right. So what they did was. They were just so bad all year, man. The Buccaneers. He just immediately. They really were. But we didn't want to accept it until yesterday. It's call, but it's Mike McCarthy's overview. He's got a blessing. Right. And he said, go for it. And I give Mike McCarthy high marks. He stayed out of the way last night, but he decent. had to make one, he had a one choice. And this is game changing right, right here. Yes. Let's go. He had a and decent um, coaching game. Great job, McCarthy. He yep. calls a play that is virtually indefensible. Yeah. You're going to roll. You're going to go Damn, and yeah. make it. Go yeah. left. Yep. But it's a run. I mean, these stop. players were just. And, and uh, it, it's hard, man. It's hard. Yeah. I got Dalton. Yeah. Yeah. I'll say the players were a little more disciplined, but yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I want to know, man. Yeah. You know? Okay. Okay. And and it's just wide open on mm -hmm. the flank because nobody, nobody is home. Mm -hmm. Nobody. Hey, everybody's selling out to stop the runs. Okay. It was the game of his life. Or what? Zeke was. Zeke will probably get in there, but it's also just out in the one before. You gotta expect play action. I got that. Put it in Zeke hands. It's a playoff game. You gotta put it in Dak's hands. One playoff game. In fact, last night. Tom Brady had won as many playoff games going into the game as my Cowboys have first won time. in their lifetime. Yeah, yeah, yeah and first time. 
35. Yeah. Brady lost to the Cowboys, man. And all of a sudden, we, we got it. All right, let's end this. Let's see the end of this segment. So it, it was way off or way off Lenny because last night playoff Lenny had five playoff Lenny did, yards, had a terrible year for six yards. playoff Lenny had a terrible year rushing. man they can't rush which they cannot run to be sure White's pretty really good so, yeah I like Rashad White to be dead last in play action passing yeah. it was 15 percent of the time because who's going to honor play action passes so he throws mm -hmm. a career high 66 passes because they can't run it but they're lost. They're hopeless. Right. They're a mess. That's yeah, what they were. It's done. Brady's not going back there, man. I really think Brady's going to leave. I really think Brady's going to leave. Like you are committed uh, get, uh, to throwing the football. No. His contract is up, right? The commitments get right? Right? People think that you tossed the ball the first run, you're supposed to break off a 50 or 60 yarder. It doesn't work like that. I agree. It doesn't, yeah. but honestly, and you should be able to get some year, runs, man. Yes. Big runs. You know, my team did exactly what my team should have. Yes. If it didn't do cowboy things. Right. And it didn't right. do any cowboy it, things it except for the kicker. No turnovers. Yeah. I'm I'm more surprised. I'm surprised there's no the no turnovers. Plays. Not played, not how bad the buck because I've seen this from skip, we've seen this the whole year. Oh, you yeah. can't you cannot go on an entire I season, agree. seventeen games, score more mm -hmm. than twenty four points. Yeah, Twice. it was clipped. It was a bad. It was clipped. Like we all thought that Brady, you know, getting the playoffs, it's all totally different. But nah, it was just bad this year. This year, it was. It was Super Bowl quality or swarthy. Well, you definitely didn't see it last week. They played. They got Brock Brady, Dak Prescott, Jalen Hurts, and Daniel Jones. One of those four quarterbacks is gonna be in the Super Bowl this year. That's crazy, dog. And I hope you guys like Cowboys losing next week. Appreciate y'all support. I'm gonna catch y'all in the next. We'll be back with Skip and Shannon on Monday. Appreciate y'all. Peace.